Hello guys, this is Jamie and welcome back to the next Factions episode. Today we are over on pvp.yarcon.net, over on Faction Silver. And you guys will see there's a big change to our box in between episodes. And yes, we have completely changed this whole area. So we've got so much more storage now. I really, I need to read. Before we get into today's episode, I just want to say I'm going to doing a Minecraft account giveaway again. I know a lot of you guys requested for me to bring these, uh, bring these back. And yeah, I decided that I'm most probably going to a... Uh, I'm going to be starting to bring these back. So, uh, yeah, remember down in the description if you go and want to go and check that out. The winner to the IG spawner giveaway is also down in the description. And I'm going to be doing another IG spawner giveaway in today's episode. So if you do want to enter that, feel free to leave a like, subscribe. And then once you've done that, comment your IG down below in the comments. And then I'll be able to pick someone for next episode. And yes, as you can see, we've got four iron golems here that we are able to give away to you guys. Uh, but I'll do those over a few episodes. But yeah, obviously... I've completely changed this now. I lowered the hopper floor down by four. And as we can see, I've added a load more of these Enderman spawners up. So we've got a lot more now. And as you can see here, yes, perfect. I've added four more on those so we can make the pillars uh, longer now. And obviously we can fit a lot, lot more in. So that's all good. I have got my old AFK. -ing. And if we go around here onto the other side, then we've got the creepers AFKing here. Uh, and these also make me quite a bit of money, uh, mainly just for TNT. I have got a lot of TNT. Uh, but yeah, as you can see here, we does it does make good amounts of money. It's not the best, nowhere near as good as Enderman, but that's how I've managed to get the money for that. Now, uh, what is, as, as you just saw there, I just spawned Hellforge, which was a, it's a really, really good custom enchant. Uh, because what it does is, as you're walking around, then it fixes your gears. So, I have got it on here at the moment, Hellforge 3. I have made a G set in between episodes. So, yeah, anyway, what we're going to do, I think we're going to put it on there, perfect. So now, those two items, as we're walking around, let's just see, will it get fixed? Uh, is, yes, it's fixed, there we go. So like a lot of you guys have uh, have asked or for, is for me to do a load of, uh, few leaks for next season of Factions. Now, that is something I'm going to be doing. I'm just going to do a couple more, a couple things in the video before we do those. So, yeah, anyway, what I'm going to do, uh, we just got, I just saw, we just got that from a level 30 enchant. I'm going to do, I'm going to get up to level 30. And as I say thank you to a fake account name, who donated a few blaze. We've got a lot of blaze spawners now, and they're pretty much in Instant, like they, they never run out we can just continue grinding forever now okay so as you can see here we are getting up to level 30 perfect level 30 and i throw out those colors so, so all there we go we just made like we made like 16k from that and yeah as you can see here i got i've got a grinding sword here i really need to rename it actually uh let, get to level two after so we can rename that but here we go let's get a rare and we got venom too which isn't the best but it's for our bows but on here on this thing here we have actually got Inquisitive 2 so it's actually a really good enchant it means you can get uh, more XP from blaze you guys are probably know what it is but okay we're gonna get to level 5 I'm gonna be able to rename this to our grinding sword now Jamie a grinding sword perfect so there we go guys now so we're never gonna miss that now and as you can see here in our e-chest we got a, we got an actual G set one so that's pretty good uh, but yeah a whole G set is pretty OP it took me like maybe three four hours to grind for it but don't worry it's definitely worth it but as as we are talking about this comment of the day is coming in today from dump truck love gaming videos he said the archon is only unbanning everyone because it, uh, as it is now dead everyone most likely got banned for fake hacking videos and actually and i'd say it's not it's not at all that the archon as you can see here we've got 172 people on and it's like midday uk time so it's it's not really peak time and it's got a lot of people on so I really don't think silver's definitely not dead. Some other colours aren't as popular as they used to be, definitely. But Russia coming back this uh, this Tuesday is hopefully going to be able to change that. There are so many people that are false banned from, like, bad staff members. So that's pretty much why they're going to do it. Uh, and it just give all those people, like Russia said in his video, a second chance in order to be able to play on the Archon. For those people who can't really afford unbans, uh, who don't want to have to buy them, then, yeah, you've got a second chance here not to hack or do anything bad like that. And, we, oh, my, we're just using the wrong sword again. I should have got my grinding one out. Here we go. Okay, so we actually got to level 30. Let's do a rare uh, Molson 3. I don't even know what that is. Uh, okay, that gives you a chance to set enemy on fire. That's not, actually not too bad. So I'm going to pull that in here. And as we're doing that, I'm going to go slash home storage. I'm going to show you guys a brand new thing that we're doing in, in our fact. So, yes, I don't know if you guys saw my live stream yesterday, but I live stream actually quite a lot on here. If you do want to be notified, when I live stream, hit the bell button down by the subscription. Uh, but yeah, that'd be appreciated if you did while well, they watch my live streams. I live stream nearly most days, uh, well, every other day, I'm pretty sure, on here. But obviously, you can see these holes here. Now, if we go down into them, these are boxes. Now, we have created these really, uh, these small, they're like small boxes and the chest storage. You know the main ones? If you want a box that's all the way from there 
to the top up there, this size, including all of these boxes down here, so all the way down to here. Then the, those are six mil now, but you can have whatever you want in there, but we have given people the opportunity to get their own smaller boxes and 7-Up if they need them. So a small box like this, this is a small uh, chess box. You've got a lot of dubs of gear. You've got, what, like 26 dubs in here. And in here, you can do whatever you want. You can say, you set, obviously, you set home. You can store, do what you want. Uh, and then what we're going to be doing is we are selling these for 500k. So a small chess box like this is going to be 500k. So if you do want to get one of these, slash mail send underscore Jamie underscore. And then just tell me you want one. Uh... Just say you want to buy one, say either 500k, because these ones are 500k. If you want these ones over here, uh, you don't get both ones. We just haven't sold these yet. These, these ones here are 750k if you want a larger one. And if you want the really big ones, like I showed off down here, these ones are one mil here. So if you guys want one of those, feel free to do slash mail, send underscore Jamie and Scott, and just tell me that you want one of those pretty much. Alright guys, so what we're going to be doing now, we're going to be doing a little bit of spawn PvP in our new G set that we've actually got. And I'm going to be talking a little bit about a lot of the leaks that we have got for next season, some information on it. So if you may not have got from Russia, all that good kind of stuff. So yeah, anyway, so first off, I want to say the release dates. I want to confirm these. So new factions, Phantom Dimension, which is the one Russia's going to be playing on. He is opening that on Tuesday. And the new, well, what you call it, the Aqua, in which they're kind of competing against each other. Uh, these new two servers well new server and then aqua aqua i believe is resetting on thursday and if you've got any ranks from amethyst or anything i'm pretty sure you can transfer them to aqua as well so that's to do with when they are opening the unban all which a lot of you guys have been asking about today it well asking about is today it's sometime today random time i pretty much just show it's when curtis is on sometime uh you'll be able to just run a command and whatever and unban everyone i, I assume it's going to be a lot of lag because uh, they've got to unban like tens of thousands of people. But anyway, all of you guys will be able to have your second chance over on the Archon. But what we're going to be doing, we're going to be talking about first about a leak. So this came from Napkin and as you can see here, there is, I'm going to put this, there's a screenshot on the screen here, level progress. So as you can see there, you've got the books and then you've got the, you've got the enchanted book. So that means that, that mission or challenge looks like it's been complete. And as you can see, it looks like there's three pages of them. So, yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, so what these challenges are is it's kind of like the old rank up system on the Archon. So you guys know where you used to do such warp rank up. Then if you have money, you'd be able to uh, rank up your rank, get a better rank in game. So that was like, I, I managed to get to $100 rank on silver just from ranking up in game. It was actually really, really good and I really liked it. I think that was like a really good time during the Archon last summer when Eula kicked in. Now, I don't think this is an, a thing, a response to Eula coming back, but it's definitely a new feature that I think is actually really good. So, I'm not too sure whether it's going to be on Aqua, whether it's going to be on Phantom, but anyway, it, what it is, is it's a new rank up system where what you can do, you obviously complete cha maybe challenges, missions, uh, you pay some money, you get pay some XP, something like that. Uh, and kind of like the F challenges, maybe that like from last map on Amethyst. But what it is, it's a new rank up. And when you unlock certain ones, you can get money rewards, in game items, you can get keys, you can get slash fly, and you can also get the in game ranks. So that is something that I really like the idea of. It's something else to do. You can progress through there. As you can see, it looks like 20 pages. So there's a lot there. There's 45 on that page there. So. It looks like it's actually going to be pretty good and you're going to have a lot of them to do. So anyway, that's pretty much the level up process. I think that's going to be a really good feature. If they add some good prizes to that, some good challenges, it's going to be really good. So yes, what I also want to say is there's a new monthly crate out on the Archon. So that's not really a leak, but that is something that's out for the new season. And also there is going to be a brand new custom enchant plugin, I believe. This is not 100% confirmed, but... I don't think it's like the crazy enchants like there are on silver. Goes create the crazy enchant plugin was only temporary whilst they're coding this new plugin. So yeah, this is what they're doing. And I'm gonna put a, sc a screenshot up on the screen. This was sent in by Curtis. And as you can see here, you've got you've got three enchanted books. And as you can see at the top, it says enchants. So maybe these are three different level enchants you can get. As you can see, as we hover over that hopper, it says a levelizer. So I'm not really too sure what that will do. I don't know what the e-chest will do. I don't know what the 
other thing will do a cobweb or it's hopper will do so if any of you guys have any ideas i think this is definitely to do with the new custom enchant plugin that's coming so yep if you have any idea of what these are then please leave a comment down below uh any suggestions are welcome uh i did ask i did ask him but uh he didn't seem to give it he didn't want to give us any more information about that so we're just leaving it like with that leak today the new custom enchants which is going to be a big part of it there's going to be 40 custom enchants uh, on the new server i believe so yes also we've talked about the f top prize that is going to be five thousand dollars it's not going to be five thousand first it's going to be split up probably maybe three two one three or maybe three thousand five hundred one thousand five and then five hundred uh, i'm not too sure it's probably going to be split up like that and like i said last episode it's going to be the top five factions on factions phantom and top five on Aqua, and I believe Aqua is also changing its name, Aquatic, that's what people were saying, uh, he said that in his video. So, as you can see now on the screen, this is the, well, what looks like a spawn for the new uh, Phantom Dimension. So, as you can see, obviously, it looks like, this looks like some like, weird eye of Ender that's purple, and if we zoom in, uh, if we zoom in, as we can see, I don't, I would, don't even know if I can zoom in on here, but... What we can see is actually there is a sign on there, and that it says five thousand uh, dollars top. So that's pretty much confirming the five hundred dollars F top price. He did, although we have said in other places as well. So yeah, that is pretty much going to be all of the leaks for today. Uh, if you do want any more leaks, then feel free just to leave a comment uh, and just tell me you want some more leaks, and I'll definitely be down to get some more. But anyway, yeah. Okay, so I just put in one of the discords I was in, this screenshot, the Curtis centers of the custom enchant thing. And some people seem to think that the levelizer was actually something maybe an auto mining thing for your base trenching, auto trench, something cats, kind of something like that. So it's kind of odd, but I'm not really too sure. So if any of you guys have any ideas, like I said, uh, feel free to leave them in the uh, comments. But yeah, obviously, we've got some things up on AH. I'm trying to get up to maybe 12 mil. We've got some hoppers on. They're cheaper in shop. We've also got Overload overload 4 and Anti-Gravity. So when we sell that, we'll hopefully be on around 11 mil. So we have got one ultimate crate key left, and we've got... Uh, wait, we've got to do Sash Claim to get the common keys. There we go. Let me spam that. We'll get Sash Claim. And we've got five common crate keys now. So I did uh, I did do some of these last episode, but we can get pretty uh, we can get pretty good. Okay, we got twenty dollar kit. I don't particularly want that. There we go. Let's shut them out and golden apple. Someone some lucky guy can have the XP from there. That's worth quite a bit actually. So here we go. Let me see what can we get from here. Ten k, not too bad. That's easy money. Let's see what else we're gonna get after this. I'm gonna open up one XP and common money. So we just got five k and some XP. I'm gonna keep the XP actually. That's actually pretty good. We're gonna open two more of these, and we can open up our ultimate crate key. If we win something good from the ultimate crate key, I'm gonna be pretty happy. XP and common money. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna put these in my e chest because I don't particularly want to lose them. Uh, in case like we someone drops something in our inventory, or if we get like, something good from the ultimate crate key, and what we're gonna get 10k again. So we just made quite a bit of money from that. And finally, what I'm gonna do, we're gonna open up the ultimate crate key. What are we gonna get? Hopefully something good. I don't really want a kit because we have them already, but hope. Oh my god! Wow, we got a kit. Uh, I mean, it's it's XP, I guess. At the end of the day, this guy here, you're gonna be lucky when you come back. You can have a bit of this gear as well. There you go, dude. There we go. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put all this XP in here, and I'm gonna I'm gonna go and put some. I'm gonna put some gaps in here. Uh, I'm gonna put some creeper eggs in here, and I'm gonna put a couple. Uh, I'll put two uh, two blaze spawners. So if anyone wants to come and get those, there's get okay, free spawners. You can have some people's heads as well. There we go. Coordinates are here. So yeah, send me a message on Discord if you manage to get this. And wow, we're on like a thousand. We're on like a thousand FPS, and that's pretty good. So yeah, send me a message on Discord in your next chest if you do get here first. And yeah, anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you remember, if you're new, subscribe. And remember, I have got giveaways down in the description. And we just fell in half a rip. And I'll see all you guys in the next Factions episode. Goodbye.